Oh, it's okay. still like pretty fucking bad. But are we live? I, are we live? Stream. Are we live? Oh, it says you guys are on. We are live. Hi guys. Wow. Professionalism, two o two. So um, how you feeling? I just showered. Feel good. Yeah, yeah I should have showered too. It's Feel flooding good. outside. Maybe you should show everybody. Yeah, it's actually. I uh, fucked that. I'm not moving this. Amaz, Amaz told them us to show them. I am not moving this camera. Amaz said to show. You do. I don't want to do it. I can rotate the monitor. That's the do most that, I can yeah, do. do that. That's the most I can do. I mean, it does show the entire room, though. And it's in a pretty crass, you know, state. Okay, okay. I feel, I feel, you know, it's not, you know. It's cool. Yeah, I don't, I don't feel good about it, Rex. I'm not wearing PJs today. I, I am. Um, oh, you are? Yeah, I, I felt like uh, we had to keep up appearances, it was, it was stay nice casual yesterday. and whatnot. Yeah. So, um, Rexful, did you sleep? I slept a little bit. Yeah, I slept a little bit. Yeah. I, I, okay. Um, you asked Rekro if he's okay with telling the story? I have not asked, and okay. I would rather ask before I told the story. Yeah. I was not even there, it was fun. but let's just put it that way. Nobody knows what happened. They were huge. Specifically. They were huge knockers. Yeah, it, they were knocking hard. Uh, wait, the mic's way over there. Yeah, I, I just basically watch-faced everyone. Okay. Yeah, you want me to move this closer? Sure. All right, I think they can hear us now. Yeah, probably. Well, they could probably hear us It's before, raining right? so loud, you know. Jeez. Yep. So, um... Highlander, did you ever play that format? No. No, you didn't. Okay. I did. I, I, like, I like watching it because there are more unpredictable plays going on, you know? Yeah. Um, one thing to note, though, is that, you know, unlike uh, the Highlander you might expect, everybody can play a Reno decks three times. Only have they, one Reno. they can only have one Reno across the, across the three decks. So it's like it's Highlander in a way, but it's Highlander across three decks, which makes it so you have 90 different cards. And a Moss can punish you. For messing up, right? So if you, you know, do like the strike row yesterday, you probably end up with an ancient watcher or a millhouse mana storm. Um, I still want to see millhouse. Yeah. More than I want to see ancient watcher. People could actually mess up because it's easy. I mean, you, 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 it's hard to cross check. Yeah. It's really hard, especially for the you, triple priest man. You forgot you put one heal bot in one deck and you tried to put it in some other deck later. You know? It's it's worse with even like jankier cards because like the truth uh, delay, delay really is like like a card like uh, Jeeves that you might want to put into like two aggro lists that you don't even think about when you're building two you shamans. You think about Jeeves. You think about Jeeves. Do you? Okay, like Crackle. He's a good guy. Bolt, Rockbiter. You yeah. might forget. Yeah. Right. It's hard to make two shaman lists. That's actually the Wait. easiest. It's easier to make two shamans because like I remember Wait, why? Kalento, it, we, I did Highlander and Challenge Stone right with Crip. Uh, I was well, there are a lot of different burn spells you could use. Yeah, you could use like you can build a mid range shaman, a control shaman, a re like with reincarnate and stuff. Yeah, and but all, all your between all your shamans, yeah. wait, someone has triple shaman or no? Two two shaman. Yeah, two shaman for admirable. Okay. Yeah. So he's someone like, has triple priest. Triple priest is doable. You That's only have I one did. powered shield between three priests. Yeah. That's rough, man. Yeah, it's all right. One all right. holy nova between all three. But there's better tools. One light bomb between all three. Yeah, but that's all only going in the same deck, right? You have the one with like all the silences and the arcane golem shadow bomb remind last. So that's one list, and then you got the hyper control. With I want to see that one win a game. Yeah, it has to. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't have to. <laughs> it, it does. <laughs> I, the thing is, I don't know if Zelay is gonna build it. There's a chance Zelay just tries to build like three mid range control, and it just completely. He's gonna do like one max priest probably, right? Yeah, I think it's like the update repair yeah, bot is kind of a given. Yeah. Dragon Freeze might be good, actually. Oh, yeah. I kind of I forgot about that. I forgot hey, about that. Why, why did we forget back. about it? Did it ever get nerfed or something? It didn't, right? No, but the thing is, like, so back, back in the days uh, where was... I did that challenge, I didn't even know that was a thing. It wasn't playable yet. Wait. So... Hey, why did people stop playing Dragon Freeze? It was so good for a while. I'm trying to think. Because uh, you, you still died to other control decks? Because you don't have the hyper control, right? So you lose the control warrior. You had, you had, unless... like, sometimes you had Confessor or Sarah or something. Right? What? Yeah, it's, it's true. You yeah. can include this, but like it doesn't work as well as you'd like. It's not consistent enough, I think. The thing's like, Control Priest basically grinds you down. Dragon Priest has a bad opener and they lose. Yeah. So they were really good against Agro, though. Yeah. So, but Agro... Remember Agro is so annoying, and then the Twilight Guardian so annoying, right? <laughs> yeah, the four job just... Uh, the thing is... The uh, two four taunt, <laughs> three six taunt... And the list that went hybrid and put Death Lord on three, you're like, come on! Can you really do this? I hate that. Uh, I'm gonna pretend I know what he just meant. Oh, Death Lord. Okay. Death Lord yeah. on three. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought you said Death Wing. Death Wing on three uh, is pretty good. Up. You just like. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Death Note on three, you know, it's, it's pretty, pretty standard. Sick. Yeah. Yeah. I've done it with a lot of robot. Yeah. Me too. And rogue. Can you can you can you like post rotation? Is your rogue deck building going to consist of conceal conceal alarm robot alarm robot big old gods? Is that going to yeah. be your deck building? That's pro. Yeah. Alarm robot conceal is fun. Alarm yeah. robot master of disguise just costs too much mana. I, I don't think they'll let us keep master seven mana. Uh, no, it, it's it's bad anyway. Uh, I I like. Like, I want to know if they're going to do something with the old gods, because, like, you have one that's 7-5, one that's 6-6, six, six, one that's 5-7, right? So it's all 12-12-12 total okay. in Stats Edition. Um, will they have, like, a crazy card that has anything to do with that? Or is it just, like, an accident? Or, like, a, a kind of a, an Easter egg, I guess? No, they just decided their battle cries were that good. That... Wait, wait, so why would you even want to... I only have a Yogg's Tehran. What do the other ones do? Yogg-Tron has a crazy battle card. 7-5 spells. Nazoth brings out like Death Rattles 5-7, right? It's a battle card that brings back all your Death Rattles? Yeah, that died this game. Well, those, those cards suck to alarm about out. No, 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 but I mean, like, so do you, do you, do you think card. Blizzard... No, 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 you don't want to do that with battle card. A charge is the only one you'd get out, right? There's a charge one? No, the one that just at the end of the turn brings out a charge or whatever his name is. I don't know who that it's is. It's a big old god. It's a 10-10. Okay? okay, okay. Yeah, it's a 10-10. Cool. Okay. Yeah. 10, 10 for 10? Yeah. 10, 10, 10. I don't know. When you guys had questions, when they had questions in the Jeopardino about the new cards that haven't come out yet. You haven't. None of the, uh, half the players have never looked at them. You know? Yeah. Half the people in there. Because they don't do like YouTube content, so they don't give yeah, a crap they, about Yeah, some of them don't care at all until they come out. So. They were telling me they were mad. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Were you mad? No, I, I wasn't you, even in you, it. You didn't care. even care, right? Like, no, no, I didn't no care points. at all. <laughs> <laughs> that, must, that must feel good for your teammate, though. Strife Pro? Yeah, just Strife not caring. It's oh no no no! I cared to help Strife Pro win, but those questions in the second Jeopardino were really hard. Oh, yeah. Okay, starting. The only one I actually thought was easy was the blurred pictures. The rest was a mess for me. So all the blurred pictures were hard except for crowd favorite. I thought I couldn't see anything. Yeah. So Zelay, so did he win or lose or what? Like he's got a dead priest. Oh, he forgot to deck build. What? Did he not manage to deck build? Wait, how how can he have a dead priest? Oh, I mean, he resurrected later. If you don't manage to build all three decks in time, your deck's dead? I don't know, I, I, I haven't heard about that, but okay. maybe maybe Amaz is currently editing it to include like a janky card on the curve. I just want to point out that Admirable's hand is right, disgustingly so good. Yeah. <laughs> Admirable and Zelay have the worst sets of classes. No, I think I think Zelay has uh, the absolute best. Triple Priest is the best. And Double Shaman Hunter. Double Shaman's good, though. Triple Priest and you can't... Shield? Dude, you can't you can only shield threw in, everything out? You can shield in one of your three decks. Yeah. That's crazy. That's fine. That's crazy. That's good. Who cares? Admirable threw everything out. Okay. He had Rock Biter, two two drops, and a three drop or something. Oh, he's going in, coin power mace, boom. Hopes to top deck a mech. But there's your bomb lover now. That's only one mech in the whole deck, probably. Actually, Clento built a deck, uh, like an aggro shaman, when we played against each other. Mech shaman, he he drew like a god. It was like Mech Warper, like Highlander with Mech Warper and Zapomatic and like Anoyotron Cogmaster on Python 4. He only has yeah. one Mech Warper and one Yeah, yeah, Zapomatic. exactly, like one of everything. And... Cool. Manatai Totem, right? This is what happens now? Oh, the, the end of the game right there. Ooh. Oh! Okay. <laughs> good game. Well, the thing is, there's a dragon in hand. There's Blackwing Corruptor. There's Bomb Lover. There's yeah, Chill. Oh, good. He, good thing he drew another dragon because he wanted. To, uh, yeah. yeah. It's only for those hungry dragons. So what do you give there, Pit Snake? Ty uh, that's fine. Okay. Now next turn he'll Corruptor the Mana Tide. Right. So that's still pretty brutal. Yeah, it's still rough. But like he's gonna be overloaded on five, right? Like Admirable is gonna be. So there's a good turn for uh, for Zelay to catch up. It's just it'd be nice if it was. One of the bad totems, like Searing Totem, he could just be Corruptoring a 3-2 instead. That's not bad for later. Yeah. It's not bad. Yeah. Well, how do you play that turn if you're admirable? You're overloaded. Like, you, you need to play, what, Argent Horse Rider? He has Dust Devil in his deck. I yeah, it, it's great with Tunnel Trog, though. It gives you wins that you wouldn't expect. You say wins or wins? <laughs> it, it's a bit of both. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Okay, Holy Nova. Nova has to come out. Oh, boy. Look at that Dust Devil. Scariest thing he's ever you, seen. You have to apologize, LA. You have to do it. Bam. My apologies. Admirable is smiling still. 
Why know. is this hunter dead? Isn't it? Did they have a ban on conquest? Maybe that's what it is. Oh, they have a ban. If they've got a ban, that explains everything. Ban. They have a ban. Ban, ban. We read the rules. I don't know. Did you? No. I did no, not. Listen, they don't tell us anything. We yeah, just come we in here. Just... <laughs> we don't even have headsets. We don't. We don't hear anything from the outside right, room. Right. We're just in this room. The game. We don't know when the game's gonna start. We don't know who's playing. Yeah, like we don't know when the rain's gonna stop. Nothing, dude. Like information. We is don't scarce. know the future. We don't know the past. Chillmaw worked, and Admirable Mutter damn oh, it under his beard. Can, okay, he's a little... Maybe he was a little scared of Earth Ellie because Shadow of Death, but there's only one Shadow of Death between all three precincts. there's sticks. a BGH and Entomb. Yeah. You gotta be scared. But man. there's only one of each between all three you decks. You gotta be scared. And he doesn't have an answer. He doesn't have a dragon. Maybe he's thinking if his Gnomish can give him an answer. Yeah. We don't know what his deck has. If he plays Bomb Lover... He's thinking about probably Bomb Lover. Yeah, he's like, Bomb Lover, I can't let this make this work, please. Get executed evil. Oh man, this is scary. Yeah, it's a big. He might just doom hammer and go face. Oh, he can't doom hammer. Okay, he's overloaded one too many. Ancestral spirit boy. Nope. Wait, he's close enough to lethal next turn. He's got it. If there's no uh, way for Zelly to stabilize, that is a taunt. That's you know, a taunt. it is a taunt, and he gets to kill the big dude. He should check his draw and acolyte first. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Defend of Argus would be good in a spot like this. Alright, he's checking his draw. And... It's not that good. Help. But Shield must be in this deck with Valence Chosen, right? If Idis isn't there, then surely he's playing those things. He's probably... Divine Spirit... Okay, he's probably gonna... No, Mish, and do the Worm Station, huh? Yeah, you check the draw first. If you pick up a Dragon, maybe you play the, the, the Guardian instead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... Although, I guess there's merits to playing, like... Three minions instead of just the Guardian and the Gnomish. You play the like Idis and the Wormrest. And then it lets you buy time, but. You have you to find a dragon, no matter what. You can still play Idis, Gnomish, and Wormrest. Yeah, but that's the thing, like, if you want to play Twilight Guardian. Oh, he drew a dragon. He did. So is he gonna. Okay, he's still gonna drop a little console, you play the Idis. Okay. Yeah, I now, think I agree with that. Yeah. Well, no, is he dead? We need to do the mathematics. Well, you can shatter on the 3-3 three, three to kill the 4 oh, health four. minion. So, yeah. And, and then 2 damage phase. And then 4, four damage phase. And then 3 damage phase. Dude, it's one off. It's one off. One off. Yeah. And there's a taunt coming up. And there's no way to go through so it. So he's just going to get him to 1. But we do... There is some hope. He yeah. has a taunt. And it's a big one. I think Emmer Bull might hold on to Bolt. Yeah, there it yeah, is. Yeah, because he could get Spell Heart. Oh, man! This is oh. insane! It just gives it one more attack, though, right? No, it just... You know... There's a lot of cool stuff. Why is it insane? Well, it's just a big dude. If you have a heal bot in the deck, if you got Earth, like, I don't oh. know what else he's got. He's played Earth. I thought, I thought you were excited about the double battle crown. Oh, no. I was like, it gives it one more attack. No, no, it's, I not, think. it's not exciting. It's not exciting. This is Pretty not sure. like... <laughs> <laughs> this is not Twilight Drake. Oh, my God, this is crazy. <laughs> it's got to have one more attack. <laughs> It'll hit the shaman <laughs> twice for four. Oh. Holy. Yeah, dude. No, no, but, like, there was a lot of... Because uh, the thing is, like, I'm guessing there's Earthling Farce or possibly heal bot in there, right? If he's playing heals in the form of minions, then I got a feeling this could be the deck where that gets equaled. So right, you have so to on, heal yourself, dude. Yeah, like, you, you have, have no yourself. choice. You have no on, choice. On board, well, I, with the lightning bolt, he doesn't know about the lightning bolt. With the lightning bolt, the 3-2 and the lightning bolt can kill the taunt. Yeah. Six health taunt. And then he has four damage to doom hammer to face. So, so he might be thinking about like, setting up a crazy board. I think he's going to heal. He's going to brand, fall guard, and heal. Here we go. Yeah. It's the only play. Okay, now MC tech. Uh, the Shaman wants to draw two damage. Well, Crackle. Or Evo or Earthshock or something, you know? Yeah. Iron Beat. Whatever. What would he draw? Uh, not quite it. That's gonna be tough. Because now that's okay, so phase damage. Two off going. Again. Oh, he was one off last time. This burn is scary, though. But he's and, dead uh, next turn, man. Well, it depends on the draw. Well. If, if you're right and he has a heal bot on his deck, he could just all of a sudden heal. No, I mean, even, even, even with Healbot, that's- Oh my Evil god! Evil Heckler! Oh, no way! He's still dead, but, um, you know. Yeah. <laughs> the option kill. is that he wasn't. He can't kill the, uh, It was pretty. Uh, Wait. No, he can't even trade this entire board away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's nothing. The dream yeah. is dead. He's very dead. He's not- He's not- Actually, not very dead. He's, like, slightly dead. Well, I mean, the Fell River gets to hit him in the face for eight, and he has four health, but- So, is, know, it, is it Conquest? I think it is, right? 
So if it's Conquest, then Admirable, like, giving information about his deck, Zalei wants to mill as many cards as possible if he thinks he's dead, just because that way he knows what's not in the other decks. You, you think that's why he's not conceding, you mean? Well, I mean, if I'm playing here and I know I'm dead, I just... Now, let's see he's thinking about something. What are you thinking about? Yeah, do I mill him twice? Wait, let's think. To see, like, six cards from his deck. Everybody guess what he's thinking about. Uh, am I why, down? Why didn't they get me shrimp tacos for breakfast? Or why did they get me shrimp tacos for breakfast? Shrimp tacos? That was weird, right? Did they hate you? That was a weird breakfast. Why would you do this, LA? It's Highlander. I am disappointed. He's I, not gonna I show coached this He's guy. He's not going to show many more cards, though. You know. uh, but the guy know. shows you six. You know what's not ever elsewhere, right? Wait, you wait. show two, the guy shows you six. With Fell Reaver. Oh! Oh! Oh, with the Fell Reaver. Ah. No, I thought you meant well, he's not. He's going to show any more cards next turn. No, right? no, no, but... Yeah, you're right, you're right. You're very right. I'm very right? You're very right. Not just right? Oh, super, man. Super right. Ultra right. Okay, that's the other deck. Or is that the same deck? How do you know? It's not the class that's going to tell you. We have no idea. Okay, so Admirable built like something that looks like a mid-range shaman. Why does Admirable have a hunter with a checkpoint and like an X on it? Ancestral Spirit. Coming out. I mean, Sylvanas. This can't be the same deck, but I thought Ancestral Spirit would fit in the deck with Earth Ellie, so I'm not sure what's going on here. This looks like a standard control priest from Zelay. No, it could be. It could be like Karen and uh, Sylvanas with Ancestral Spirit and. Oh man! I forgot the name. Oh yeah. There we go. I forgot the name of the other card. That, uh, Reincarnate. Yeah, that one. Yeah. So Reno for Admirable. Yeah, he's already got the Reno in hand. Sylvanas Reincarnate is so good. It's disgusting. You and this get, is the get best to, card. You for just Sylvanas. get to mind control for the cost of a reincarnate. So ten mana. What does reincarnate cost? Like two. Yeah, it's two mana. No, it's pretty insane. That's gonna be really useful later on, though. They just throw out Death Lord, or are you worried about Hex? Yeah, you're never worried about Hex on a Death Lord. It's a Dude, three drop. This Tuskar Totemic is nasty because it came out of Scarab, and this is the best class to play it in, right? Oh man. That's give a bad him, one, actually. Give him Mark and I. <laughs> um, so, let's see. I mean, Valence shows him coin. Yeah, and coin. coin to full clear. Yeah. You should do it. I like it. I mean, yeah, it's hard, it's hard to say no. Yeah. That play. Hey, Valence, I guess, I guess you coin. You, Lord, I guess, I guess you bumped Lord. the Vitality Totem. You could, like, coin, Death Lord, Flash Heal. That's, kind of, that's not as fun. It's not as fun? Okay. I guess, yeah. You're going with Valens. And you're less worried about removal because he only has one in all three decks of Hex and Earthshock. I remember he had both. That's, that's yeah, well, you've already seen Bolt, you've seen Lava, Lava Burst. Okay, he, he didn't do it. Okay, so you're just going to play it slowly. Yeah. This is how you give Ancestral Spirit and to it, the Death Lord. The reason this is... Oh, he knows Flame Tongue can't be there. That's actually smart. Yeah, it's not in there. There's I was no thinking way. Flame Tongue would perfectly kill it because you'd have 5 and 3. No, it's not there. Yeah. Oh, wow. Iron B. Cowell, MVP. That was... Oh, man. The jank. Well, he... He could even just kill it. Yeah, he just, like, Valence Chosen and... Yeah. Like, Coin Heal. Valence Chosen, Coin Heal. Yeah, that sounds pretty Full good. Full clear. <laughs> yeah, it's actually really sick. Because how does Shaman push you off this board for the rest of the game? And he's saving out. Yeah. Saving out would actually be huge for him. He doesn't know. In this know. case, yeah. He, he doesn't know. Oh, <laughs> uh, he's not going to do it. Oh, man. What is this no villains? I don't know. Are we mad? Yeah, I'm mad. Maybe for Confuse. He's holding a tournament medic, Confuse, with villains oh, and Divine my... Spirit. Dude. That's obviously that, right? The villains chosen would have felt so good. Oh, man. Stalag is coming out. And then Sylvanas gonna come, he's gonna be like, oh man, I don't have an owl. What we gonna do? Nothing. Whoa. Hmm. 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 Mm hmm. I don't know, man. Looking good for the shaman. I don't know. It's looking he's... good at the cards coming up. I, I wanna say it's looking good for the priest. Wait. It seems like it's looking good for the priest, but. He's he, been playing. He's about to, he's about to lose. Uh, do you, do you not believe? Like, you just trade away the owl into. Whatever that seven four his name Stalag. No, I'm, not, I'm talking about not talking about this turn, but Sylvanas is gonna come down and then he doesn't have an answer. Okay. And he's gonna ancestral spirit it. You know, that's gonna be really annoying. Okay. So you just you just trade away the pyro here then. Yeah. Okay. That's Earthshock vulnerable. The owl dies. 
Yeah, but I guess you don't care. That's why the villains are slightly better on the pyro. Well, Sylvanas comes. comes out, then it's too early. Spirit can't that be played. Good. Yeah. Alright. Now it gets interesting. I, know I have no idea what he's gonna do. Uh, give him Deathlord? Get Malagos win? Uh, what's he using to kill it? You trade away the owl, you trade away the death lord, and, and give him with three health. Then you kill it with holy fire. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna be a game plan. No, that, you go that, for it. You just ignore bad, everything. It's not no, awful, no. but it's just. I I, I kind of like that, but I think since he has Velen, he probably has mind blast, and he's yeah. just gonna go for the face damage. I like it. Let's see what. Okay, this this is the important turn. Let's see what he gets. Alakir would be sick. It's not Alakir. Wait, that's ten damage on board for uh, for Zelay. Yeah, but only has five in hand, right? Like, Mind Blast top deck would be lethal, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Holy Smite is close enough. Wait, there's Velen's Chosen, so Holy Smite would do it too. Oh, he has 6 in hand. Oh, of, no way. Okay, no. So he's, okay, he's at 16 damage. Yeah. Um. I wonder if he'll just. He'll probably just smork and hope. Yeah, I mean, if the, the problem is that there's Reno, then. Like, you can't play around it. So it's, it's really hard to make a call. Like, do you ever make trades? And light bulb? Like, is that ever a turn? You might, you might make trades because um, you do have burst potential later in the game. You, he probably has uh, Akanai Soul Priest, so then he'll have Flash Shield right. and Hero Power for four. But I think he's thinking about Smorking because look, he just masked over his Holy Fire. Smorking won't work out. We know because Admirable has Reno. Do you know? Whoa, Reno? that rhyme. We know Reno. Wow, that's good, Rick. But I'm not a rapper. No. Huh. I don't know what to it's do. Probably here. the most important turn of the game. Yeah, but it's not obvious. I like I like trade and then just trade into the Savannah. Savannah doesn't get to steal anything. And then yeah. you redevelop a board with Colter. Nice. The Prophet Valen alone is. Oh, good he's enough, Yolo like, For him to kill this, he's got to have Lava Burst, Shock, Rock Fighter. You've seen a lot of those. You tools. can kill it with Argus. Yeah, but like there's a lot of tools he needs to have right away. So he should kill it with Argus. Use the zombie chow, and you're only healing him for one. And then the, the doomsayer, I guess. It kind of sucks to lose all their stuff, but you don't have the choice. You might ancestral spirit your doomsayer to get tempo. <laughs> you just regain the turn, and then you play manatai on your own terms. Manatai feels good here. Yeah, it's good. No. Priest needs a good draw. Cabal shadow priest, dude. Nope. That's not too fun. Well. Tempo <laughs> Reno. <laughs> yeah. Kaboom! Four six. Yeah, I'll probably call this and Gilblin. It's kind of weak, but at the same time, like nothing kills it on the board, right? Yeah, yeah. So, man, that zero three mana tide is so toxic. It depends. It depends on the priest later draws, but he might be still in it. I assume he's playing Malagos, right? Because he's got the mind blast list. Yeah, I assume. Then maybe he has Emperor too, because you need Emperor. To Malagos, Unless you play anything. the Malagos and your Dragon Priest. In which case, this suddenly gets a lot worse. But he did drop the Velen like he didn't really care about it. Yeah. So. No Mind Blast? What are we thinking about? Holy Firing the Manatide. Okay. Sure. I mean, it doesn't die to Light Bomb at all, so I guess that makes sense. I wanted to see the Sylvanas get Ancestral Spirit and be really annoying. You don't know what's coming out. There might be. Oh, that, that, that is a good here. ancestral spirit target. That is really good. Huh. Well, that's a bit clunky. I wonder what would have happened had he. Uh, Velen's the pyromancer early in the game, cleared the board, and still had Al for Sylvanas, and got keeps. I think he would have won. You think he would have won? I think he'd be on this board right he now. He might have not won because uh, Shaman had Reno in hand now. But I mean, it, not, not like the, the the long game, but it would have at least been on the board right now. As opposed to being, yeah, yeah, yeah. like, trying to fight for it. He actually might have been able to finish him that one turn when he was two off. Because yeah. he would have gotten two more damage that turn with the Pyromancer when he uh, yeah. develops. And Zillay right now just feeling... I don't think Priest is a class that Zillay likes to play too much. Uh, last time I saw him play, he was playing a lot of, uh, like, the, the combo priest with a lot of cycle with Mind Blast, but it was just for fun. I like how he's grabbing his lower lip. Yeah, it's pretty hot. Okay, maybe patient here. Maybe he's waiting for a big light bomb, but it's, two of these cards don't die to light bomb. 
Yeah, what actually, I, Admirable will not buy it, I think. He knows there's no Nova, so the only way that Zelay would consider passing is if there's, like, Excavated Evil um, or Light Bomb. Maybe Shadow Madness is in, like, a weird world, but you would have seen it already. Temple Reno, 12 health, not too bad. But, yeah, this Light Bomb's looking pretty tasty soonish. Soonish? Yeah. Not this turn. I mean, is there, we know there's a Bloodlust in Admirable's deck, so Zelay might, like, he has to be worried about that. He has to be extremely worried about Bloodlust. Yeah. So, if he Light Bombs, uh, his 2-3, he can kill the 3-5. Opponent will still have a 4-2 and a 2-1. Yeah. And a Totem. And a Totem as well, which doesn't die. Uh, but you do get to play Zombie Chan Cultist on top. So... Yeah. How much is that worth, right? Like that's kind of the question. The thing is, admirable right now with the hex Alakir, The the most important part really is the Alakir plus spirit, right? Because he can just trade it away, and unless it gets stolen through mind control, what you're... the priest really wants to see is how can I soul priest? Yeah, you get a good with that hero power for four damage. Yeah, you do whatever you want. But I guess. Whirling um, <laughs> blades. Oh no. Uh, Alakir, let's do this. Card draw. Hmm. More of it. So you know there's no Nova in Zelay's deck, since that was in the previous deck. So maybe he'll Alakir and bump the Cultist and then bump the. I think Kamisha. he's yeah. Oh, wait, he didn't bump the Cultist. I thought he was gonna do that a different way. You, to take you, a little bump, bit less you, damage, you bump yeah. the cultist, but well, maybe he's gonna use his four too. If you bump the cultist, then you bump the zombie child, and use your two one to finish the cultist. Yeah, but I mean, if you're expecting to keep the Alakir, like, or uh, you don't mind it dying through ancestral spirit, then yeah, your play was still the better one. I'm surprised you did it this way. I think he just blundered. You didn't it's think not it. a big deal. It's yeah, because well, not, he obviously didn't have it planned out because now he's hesitating. Hesitating. Yeah. Oh man. That that is like excavated evil. Okay, so he took he took one extra damage on his. Okay. What is will this it evil? will it matter? We'll see. Probably not. Oh my oh, god! Wow. Shadow of pain. Unbelievable. That whirling blade made the Alakir escape the shadow of pain range. Really big deal. Well, is that maybe Admirable was thinking? What if he steals it and trades it away into Reno with Shadow Madness? And then get his ancestral spirit himself, right? Because if I put Ancestral and he steals it oh, with Madness, then he resurrects it and I'm, I'm wrecked. He, he didn't think too much about that turn. Seems like you could possibly die from... He's not going to die, but... Could have died. It was pretty scary, yeah. It would have been on the board. It is scary right now. Okay, now... We can Reno. Let's see what he draws. That, that kills it. Uh, Shriekmeister, Shadowward Pain, Reno. Yeah, that brings you back to full health, and you remove the Alakir, which is the biggest threat you've got on the board. Okay, so here we go. That's a pretty good okay. draw there, Fizzle yeah. You only needed it, though, because of the Whirling Boys. Yeah. So that means you're probably playing Cabal Shadow Priest, which in this deck is worth a lot. So, do you Ancestral Spirit your Blood Mage ever? Just because you need the draw? Mm, yeah, maybe. Because there's very little else I'd like to, to use this on, right? We don't know what's in his deck, but yeah, maybe. Cabal Shadow Priest would be so good. Karen would be really good. Hmm. Karen that never does. Well, he dies and then Bane comes out. And then Karen runs the the NK. I, that sounds a little weird, yeah. That storyline doesn't make sense. I guess it's like Royal as a Drain on. Oh, Storm, hi. He didn't spell Power Totem, but he'd still have to Earth Shock to finish the Reno off. You might just trade away the 2 1. Yeah, either or. But he doesn't have much damage on the board now. He might want to keep his 2 1 and just use Earth Shock. Yeah. yeah, what else with the Earth Shock? Okay, Sylvana's coming out later. I mean, at this point, I think Admirable just wants to set up a Bloodlust, because we know it's in the deck, right? So as long as your board doesn't get removed by Nova, Excavated Evil, or anything along those lines. Then you're good. Would Zelay have what it takes to play Deathwing? Yeah. Reno! <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Yep. That is ridiculous. You have to. Yeah. So. And the, it's alright. Then the Shaman only has three damage on board, <laughs> and the priest is killing for four a turn, so this game could go for a while.
Yeah, because they're like basically as long as Admirable doesn't find Bloodlust, this damage on board is always going to be four on like at the max until he picks up. I guess bigger. I guess when he does pick up the Bloodlust, so, you know, yeah, he'll have a lot. Uh, probably not at, like seven. He's going to be exactly uh, maybe a little shy, I think. Well, if there's seven minutes, it's twenty-one damage plus three more. Damage, but he can only have 24. six if it's just totems, right? Because because he can't like get yeah, a fifth totem. Yeah, he's going to draw some minion eventually. Huh? That's the theory. <laughs> that's that's the theory. That's the way it should work. You gotta entomb the Zale. Believe us. We love you and we want your well being. Oh, he's not gonna entomb. Oh man. Yeah, what are we saving for? Uh, well, I guess he's thinking another he could bigger look, He's thinking he could wait one more turn. He's not wrong. Okay, so that's 18 damage. <laughs> that's 22. Oh, 24, 25. 25 damage. So he's 3 off, right? That entomb would have felt pretty tasty. Wait, he's not lusting. Yeah. Okay, so he's setting up an even bigger. Bigger lust. Oh man, he really needed Soul Priest full clear, then he could come back in the game. But. You gotta entomb LA. Believe us, we love you. Yeah. We don't say this to despite he, you. He's gonna feel like he has to know. No, he's not. Okay, so the Bloodlust does 21 damage by itself, and then there's 7 there's damage, seven on, the damage on the board. So, so that's 28, 28, he's dead. Well played! Bam! That's feeling when you play around Savage Roar and nothing else. Turns out uh, maybe Triple Priest isn't so good. Well, his draws. Look at look at how many dead cards in his hand. Well, I think Entomb was a pretty live card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like eight damage prevented plus a potential. Just flash shield and, and circle and right. shower death were dead cards. Yeah. Until Alkanai shows up, right? So <laughs> his face just said a story of a guy who's like, I don't know how that happened. Yeah. I feel like my lineup was pretty good. My decks were pretty okay. <laughs> my Triple Priest. <laughs> <laughs> pretty sick. Uh, Hmm. So, do you think like that was expected? Yeah, yeah. Even even though it was like shaman, I feel like I mean, shaman is weak to priest, right? The reason shaman is weak to priest is cabal shadow priest, which he didn't draw ever, and he can't have two of. Mm -hmm. So but shadow madness still evil. Uh, I mean, we don't. Even, I don't even know what he had. But Akanai, he needed Akanai too. He needed Akanai. He needed cabal shadow priest. Would have been fun. Yeah. Um, Amaz is walking in. I'm scared. I'm not talking anymore. Everyone hide. So, um, before we go to break, the rule for um, anybody having duplicate cards across deck lists is that I blindfold them for the rest of the game. I have won one arena match blindfolded in my life, and that was it. That's good. good if they can, chances, if they can right? do this, yeah. <laughs> they are amazing. Well, no, no, no. If they have duplicate cards. If they don't have duplicate cards, it's fine. Okay, we can cut to I break. sneaked in Trump's account, and I put in it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. See you guys later! See you guys, we'll be back after I sneak in Trump's account to mess everything up. Oh crap, he's not logged in. Well, never mind that. <laughs>